I guess it's been seven or eight weeks. I can't believe it's been that long. But I came to Lola's website through the blessings. Yeah. Room, and went to the website within two minutes of getting onto your website. I had downloaded your book and registered for the online course. <laughs> um, I read the book the first time in probably three days. Wow. And it was just like, this woman wrote this book just for me. How neat. <laughs> How nice. She's talking just to me. <laughs> Um, I, 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 did, I, I, I devoured the book. Well, you did create the book, show yeah. I did, I did, and, and then I just devoured it. Um, and I was doing the online courses, and I'm a very rules person, so I was doing exactly as Lola said, just one course a week, um, don't, you know, just do one divine opening a week, but yet I was reading the book and flipping through, uh, skipping over the divine openings, and I sure was supposed to do that. Um, so I got through the, the courses, I start, every single day on your website. That's how I begin my day. Um, if there's not something that I haven't seen that, that's new. There's always before. something and new. And in the past couple of weeks, there's something that's something new every single day. Uh, I go back and reread um, things that are on the website. Within, I created having this, I think, at exactly the right time because I had this enormous upheaval at work, enormous upheaval at work within a week. After, after finding you and finding the website. And it would have um, normally just stopped me in my tracks. But um, it didn't. I, I just had this sense that it's fine. You know, it's going to be fine. If this is the way it's supposed to happen. This was supposed to happen now. It's fine. Everything's fine. Um, and since that, I think I, I had that big upheaval I was able to get through that, and since then, my experience has been much like yours. It's just peace and bliss, and I love the raven part. I sit at my desk, and sometimes I'm, I, I'm a lawyer, so I have the, you know, I have sort of this stage job. Um, but I sit at my desk, and I'm just going, yeah. <laughs> 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 And you have a new job, right? I haven't started yet. You haven't yet, started yet. Yeah, yeah, I, you know, I, I sort of this new job, which is actually an old job, which I left to have the job I have now, loved it. There was no possible way that I was going to be able to go back to this old job. But when I had this upheaval in my new job, in two days I had my old job back. No possible way that could have happened. It had been filled, you know, no possible way. But when I would talk to the, to the, the general counsel of this company, he said, you know, as a matter of fact, we have been thinking about maybe we do need somebody to come back and do that old job. And I went, no. <laughs> <laughs> of course you will. <laughs> <laughs> um, and there's just a lot of, there's been a lot of sort of old stuff that used to get me all wound up. And it, I'm able now to, sort of my large self is able to go, you silly thing. Why, you know, why would you be wound up about that? I mean, look, it, it's sort of like saying, but look at this and this and this and this. And, I, and so my small self goes, oh. Okay, that and that and that. And my favorite, I think my favorite phrase from your book is disrespect reality. I've said that to my kids. I've said it to <laughs> Just because the world says that's true doesn't mean it's true. And we're thinking about um, putting our house on the market and it's, um, and, and, you know, you read all the stuff. We're in, in Phoenix, which is a bad market, bad market, and oh, nobody will ever buy your house. And I'm thinking, of course, you know, if we put our house on the market, some extent people will buy it. Right away. I mean, if we just, if we decide that's what we want to do, that's what's going to happen. That's what's going to happen. The energy in that house, they will just. I want this house. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it's. This has been the best, aside from Ken, of course, and my children. This has been the best thing <laughs> that has ever ever happened in my life. And thank you. Mm -hmm. And I'm so happy to be here to meet you. I feel like, I feel this heart connection, and it's just really nice to see you. We got, we both had that.